how to set up a Google meeting for your group. So I've joined a group here, and when I went in the group, I noticed that I don't know what one of the email addresses is. This student has chosen to hide their email address from public view, so I'm not sure how to, to uh, invite them to a group. So I'm going to send an email. I say, um, please email me back with your email address. Go end of message. And then that student will get an email from me. They can actually write their email address if they want. But they don't even have to. I'll show you in a minute that as long as they reply back to me, then I can actually, although I can see their email address, it's also going to be in their email here. So now I have all the email addresses from my group and I can invite them to a meeting. So I'm going to start a new tab and I'm going to go into my Google Calendar and I'm going to say next week um, on Tuesday at one o'clock, I'm going to try for a group meeting. And I'll put in the, uh, I'm going to add a Google Meet video conferencing, and I'm going to put in the email address of that one. And then I'm also going to include the email address of the other one. And I'm going to make sure that that time works with their calendars. I'm just going to go find a time. And looks like they're free at that time. If they weren't, I could move this to a different time, but I'm going to say, no, that's good. They're all free. And then I'm going to save that and I'm going to send them the invitations. So what they would receive is they get an invitation from me and they would see in their calendar that they're free then. So I'm going to go, yep, I'm good with that. And same with the uh, other student. They'd see that they're free and they'll say yes. And then when that time arrives, I could uh, start the meeting. And then uh, they could either load right through the link in their email or um, more likely they'll just have their calendar open then. And, uh, and they'll just get a pop-up saying that the, the meeting is starting now, but I'll just go, I'll, I'll join. And then the third one, I'll just show you the third one could do it right from the uh, invite as well. There. They're all in their meeting. They could present now, they could uh, work on a document together, whatever they want. Um, if you do want to work on a document, uh, they're like a Google Doc. So one, one student could uh, start a Google Doc in um, Drive. They can go new and then they could do a Google Doc. They could name it. And then they could add the other people in their group. Then the other people would go to their email and they will see that they have a document that's shared with them. It's the other group member going into their email, seeing if they can see that they have a document. And then And whatever they type will immediately be seen by the other members. When they're done, they could either uh, download this as a Word document or they could share it with their instructor. 
um, and even uh, get a link uh, in here. They could copy a link or download the downloaded one to actually submit to the document, but that that uh, is going to be covered in another video. Um, they right now that this is how to set up a meeting, and that's how it's done.